Welcome back. New tonight, many parts of central Illinois are covered in cicadas. The large and loud bugs seem to have taken over parts of the state, while others have not seen as many. Fox Illinois' Carolina Hassett got up close to some cicadas and has more. Carolina. Yeah, that's right, Eliza. I feel itchy just talking about them. But during the month of May, we have seen two broods of cicadas emerge simultaneously for the first time in 200 years. Between the noise and the size of these bugs, it may have many thinking, when will the invasion be over? Well, according to experts, it may be over sooner than you think. Are you kind of counting down the day? I hope they're, so gone they're gone tomorrow. Gone. That five of them just flew over here at once. So. Simply getting through an interview outside was challenging. Hundreds of them are everywhere. Cicadas seem to have taken over parts of central Illinois. However, some residents are seeing them in more places than others. Any place that has forests or a lot of older trees, and especially any place that had trees 13 or 17 years ago, depending on the cicada brood. The larvae of cicadas tend to feed on tree roots, which means they stay in areas of mature woods. However, why is it that you you can see them in one spot and then several feet down the road, they're gone. Newer developments that you know, may have destroyed the habitat 13 or 17 years ago. Uh, those would not probably have cicadas now, even if you have trees on your property. This also leaves the question of if cicadas migrate. They do not migrate. They're weak flyers and they pretty much stay put within you know, several hundred yards of where they were born. This means that if you are in an area where there are not a lot of cicadas, you may be in the clear. They tend to just stay in the same spot for decades. Experts say that most of the cicadas have already emerged at this point, which leaves the question of how long we will see them. I would expect the cicada season to be done in late June depending on where you're at. So we generally say once you start seeing those come out, you're really going to see adult activity for probably six weeks at the most. Which has some breathing a sigh of relief. But they're definitely an annoyance. They, <laughs> they like to land on your head and fly full speed into your face. Now, these insects are not toxic to pets if they happen to eat a couple while they're outside. However, eating large amounts of them can make your pet sick. Thankfully, in studio, I'm Carolina Hassett. Back to you. Thank you, Carolina. For more information on cicada-themed community events going on, head over to our website, foxillinois.com. Don't miss a video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel today for more Central Illinois news.